you're Harry again uh, just a quick update on what I'm going to be doing to my gaming rig okay this rig now is two years old was it three three this Christmas I think built it in 2011 um, I've changed the water a couple of times but no not done anything too dramatic to it okay that's the front of it and what I'm gonna do so I'm gonna start taking it all apart do some mods take this out excuse me this is coming out I'm gonna put a 240 in the bottom I have some temperature sensors at the back here coming from here the graphics cards and the CPU I'm not sure if to keep these in here or black this out with a nice piece of black perspex and get a new reservoir a new XSPC one of these which is flat at the front a new lamp a new Lamptron touch fan controller so I don't have all the knobs at the front this is coming out I don't, I don't need that in there uh, not sure if to keep the power supply this is an X1200 and I'm not sure if I can get the distance for the radiator in the bottom I'm not sure if I'm going to put the radiator standing up uh, USB 3 card that's coming out don't need that don't need this transfer panel for external SATA don't need any of that um, I'm keeping all the fittings I was going to hard line it with acrylic tube but I don't think I'll do that this time maybe in a couple of years time I'll just rip the whole lot out and new case and everything maybe see what's around something like the size of the D900 or something but by then I'll have a new CPU motherboard memory and everything so I think I'll wait till then and do a complete new one in a couple of years time this this has been a great PC I love it I've never had no issue with it no problems anything with it so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna to put renew the hose in some new uh, liquid in there some blue stuff this time uh, I'm gonna get one of those monsoon version 2 reservoirs and I'm going to keep everything flush at the front so I haven't got any of this this stuff showing any knobs at the front it'll just be straight down and the new XSPC version 2 one of these uh, with this and it sits flush with a nice black thing it looks really nice so try that I know it's got the allen keys in there but I can change it for these screws here so it looks a bit better um, so I'm going to start taking this apart this radiator here is going to be jacked up through the top like I did on my other half X case so I can have the fans on a pull on the inside here that will be on a pull two down here be sucking air in I'm going to take this out because I need to put the radiator right at the front I'm going to have a 140 fan one of those new Corsair fans, AF fans, blowing air across the top of the radiator. I'm going to cut the bottom of the case out so the fan will be pulling air in through underneath here with a filter on the bottom. As I say, I'm just, I should get it in, but it's very, very tight. If it doesn't fit, I change the power supply either to a Corsair 850i or one of the HX thousand, which is twenty odd mil shorter than this. I would say it's the same length as the AX eight eight sixty I, because at the moment this has got a fan I can control, got temperature sensors on it. These are just rubbish. I'm just going to cut them in the back here. Have the sensors down. Cut this out here, and have the sensors all down the back here the water temperatures and graphics card, CPU temperature, RAM, stuff like that. 
but what I'm going to do that uh, the new Lamptron I don't know if I should get that they, I see Fantech are doing a they do a splitter that I can put in to the, the motherboard up here into one of them four pin uh, you can put the three pins into the Fantech controller which is a PVA, PWM and you can put it into one of these and then I suppose I could use that uh, fan controlling software from S Asus and uh, do it that and then I haven't got to have any fan control on at all it just up and down it or oh, the fan expert that's what it's called so I might do that I'm gonna try um, I probably try that first keep the front nice and clean blue fan at the front AF these drives are going to be taken out I might cut this cut this halfway have the SSD and two hard drives in here and then the radiator will then go at the bottom up to here somewhere and see how many drives I can get in so I'm not sure to keep that but what I'm going to do now is I'm going to start taking this apart drain the water out and then I'm going to start taking out all the, the fans and I'll take out all the fan controllers and stuff so it is now Sunday afternoon 9th of November 2014 and we'll see how we get on I'll keep you updated and uh, we'll go from there right cheers for watching this Harry and I'll keep you up to date with my progress